Hello, today I'm here with a new video and if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa. I am a cool TV YouTuber that right now has no idea what she is doing. And today it's my first video for this year and I have been taking an inattentional, unintentional break from YouTube. It wasn't planned, I haven't like, oh I'm going to have a break on YouTube, I don't know. But in December I did post, I think it was 20. 20 <laughs> videos and uh, that is a little bit a lot for me and especially that <laughs> month but now it's the new year and I am no longer on the no buy okay do you know what I'm going to prime my eyes and I'm going to do my makeup and we will see where this is going I am going to use this meet me in the underworld from loose cosmetics and I was like, which palette should I use the first palette of this year? But <laughs> I do not care. Um, so yeah, primer eyes. I will leave down in the description which colors I am using. So yeah, but I think I want to do... Yeah, I don't know. Okay, so this is my first video for this year. And I did, as I said, did not plan for taking a break. I don't know if this even counts as a break, but maybe a little. But I haven't just been like eager to film. I haven't been like, oh, I want to sit down and film. I haven't felt doing my makeup even. So I haven't done that. And I don't know because last year I did have my no buy. And I was like so into that like this is the thing I'm doing and especially in the end of last year I was really like yeah no buy is the thing I am doing and it felt like I really had like a line on my shell what I wanted to do I am pretty sure that I don't want to have a no buy this year I don't know if I'm going to have like a low buy even I think I'm just going to see like where where this year takes me like how much makeup do I really want to buy? Because I have actually bought a makeup product. I have bought a new concealer. I bought this from, from Body Shop. I wasn't planning on buying this, but I was at Body Shop and I talked to one there at Body Shop. I, like at my Body Shop, I think they know who I am. <laughs> um, because I did love their old one that is going out of stock so I bought that one instead and I'm planning on using it today but that is the only makeup product that I bought so far I will buy some palettes soon I'm pretty sure um, but not just yet I think I'm just going to wait a little bit yeah so that maybe has felt a little bit like confusing that uh, I don't know what I want to do on my channel and I was really like in November and December, like I'm going to plan everything. I'm going to plan what I'm going to do next year. I'm going to plan what kind of channel I want to have. But I haven't and I don't know if that's maybe why I haven't filmed anything. But yes, I, d I don't know what I want to do. I think though that I want to post more, not that often. I tried to post like five days a week at one point but I just think that it's not for me I don't think that I do have the time for that but maybe I do but I don't know it was like getting I felt more stressed about it and I don't want to feel that so I think I maybe is going to go back to post three videos a week and maybe try to do some other things maybe not other things but trying to do like more uh, harder videos to make I don't know I, I, I just feel confused right now when it comes to my channel because I have no idea one thing that I do know that I want to keep doing is my theme weeks and I think maybe that I'm going to try to do them once a month. Um, 
and see the different themes that I will do. I'm not sure about that either, but I think that might is something that I want to do. But you see, like, planning, apparently, it has been when I'm filming this four days into this year, and I am still super bad at planning anything. Um, but I'm thinking about having... I'm going to have theme weeks. I don't know how often. Yes, they're like, I know that I want to do them. And I think I maybe want to do them once a month. And also, like, I was planning on doing a theme that is spreading all over the year. And I have had some things that I thought about that could be my theme over the whole year, but I haven't decided yet. I was thinking a little bit about doing monochromatic looks, like maybe mon one month is the purple month and I do a purple look and a blue, green, yellow, red, orange, but I don't know. I don't know if that is going to be fun. And then I was planning if I should do maybe a Colourpop palette per month because I, for some reason, I do really want to play with my Colourpop palettes. But I don't know that either. So right now I am a little bit lost on that. Um, so we will see what will happen. But now I don't know more than you do because I don't know anything what I want to do. So we will see where this year will take me. So yeah, the big thing is maybe that I'm going to do less videos and I'm going, I think I'm going to try to do a free per week and maybe then I can do, have some more planning about it and maybe don't stress out videos because it feels like I have done that sometimes and like really take my time and see how that will work for me and I think I don't want to go to being a review channel and doing a lot of first impressions I have never been that much for review channel but I have done some first impressions but it's nothing that I feel like that I want to do so I am going to this year also try to use my collection more and one thing that I really want to be better at this year is, like, if I don't like a product, I can decluttering it. And I felt that a little bit now when buying a new concealer because I haven't been using this one from Nabla. And this worked good on me until it became winter in Sweden because now... It doesn't look that good under my eyes, but I, like was like, I'm on a no-buy, I can't buy a new uh, concealer, but yeah, if I don't like my concealer, I should just buy a new one. Okay, and it's now that I'm going to do a half-cut crease with something. And did you have a good New Year's Eve? I was spending it with my boyfriend, as I usually am with everything I do. Uh, we were just at home watching <laughs> Parks and Recreation, and... Uh, Eating some good food, watch the movie, and eating some candy. That was like what we did on New Year's Eve, and that is usually what we do on New Year's Eve. And for us, that is like, <laughs> that is the thing that we want to do, honestly. Like, we are no party peeps, and we like to spend time with each other. And just... Yeah, watch a good movie, watch some series that we like, and just eating food that we do really like. Sometimes it feels like I'm too old to go on parties. Like the few times when I've been at a party now, the latest years, I'm so so tired and like after 10 p.m. I just want to go home. I just want to go home 
put on my pyjamas, pyjamas and just go to bed. I do not want to be at a party for super long because I know if I am there too long I'm going to be so tired the next day. See, yeah, I think I'm a little bit too old to party if I'm going to be honest. Or is it, maybe it's just not a thing for me. I have no idea. And it feels like I don't know, even though it wasn't like that long ago since I did actually film a video, but it feels like I, I'm always like losing it a little bit. But especially when I have had like an intense period when I have done so many videos, like after a theme week or something, the videos I'm doing after that, I'm like, how is this? How are you doing this? I can't remember like how to talk to a camera anymore and also it's a little bit like yeah I'm going to speak English I do not speak English that much in my day-to-day -day life sometimes yes but not like this much okay so I think that I will try the concealer together with you so I will just take away my fallouts with my sponge. I have actually a new sponge. It's time for that again. And I bought this one that I've heard a lot about. It's from Flair, a Swedish brand. So I'm looking forward to this. So I'm going to wet this one, take away the fallouts, and then I'll come back. Is it time to try? <laughs> time to try this concealer. This is their vitamin C concealer body shop in I have fair one end. Let's see. Oh, it feels really like airy, which I like. I, the only thing I don't like, do you hear this? It gives me the shivers. <laughs> um. With concealers, I don't want them to be like high coverage because I don't have that much to hide. And I don't want them to be like too thick. I do like my concealers really light with a medium, light to medium coverage. And it feels like this is, because the one from Nobla, I think it's pretty thick and now uh, winter, I don't think it feels that good for me actually. But this one I do like a little bit more, I think. It was really, really light. I don't know. Do you see any difference? I think I just want to take a little bit more. It felt like really, really good. And it is buildable, so I guess if you want to, you can build the coverage up. It's pretty late in the day, so I'm not going to be able to do a wear test. But I'm going to use this more, so I can tell you in the future. I think it looks good. It's really light, as I said, and it gives a little bit of a sheen. Uh, so far, I guess I'm liking it. For my foundation, I actually don't know what I want to use. Maybe I'm going to use this Bear With Me from NYX. Yeah. This has been one of my favorite foundations, or this is a tinted skin wheel, for so long. But I think they like, did they redo this pair with me? Because this is no longer available, of course. And uh, But I think they have some new bear with me things, don't they? I, I do like a lot of NYX uh, base products, but it's not the brand that I am like, super involved in for some reason. And what is this? Why are you here? 
And I don't know why it is like that because I do like the foundations that I've tried from them. Not all, but uh, a lot of them. And I have the Bear With Me setting spray that I also do really like. But I think they have come out with a new skin tint foundation, I don't know. So maybe when this is done, maybe I will look into that. I'm still a little bit red around my nose. I have had a cold that, you know, one of, of these colds that like, it feels like it's never going to end. I've had it for like two weeks, I've had the sniffles and I'm getting so sick of it. <laughs> because I'm not sick anymore, it's just all the time and it doesn't want to stop. So I do like how this looks and I do like the concealer. And okay, I don't have that like much more to talk about. So I guess that I'm just going to uh, do my face, done my brows and then I come back and see if I come up with something more to, to say. Yeah, that's a, that sounds like a good plan. Done. <laughs> I still do like the concealer. I think it still looks good, but I have it on for maybe 10 minutes. For my lips, I took Sepia from LH Cosmetics and I do like this look, but <laughs> I don't know about this video. But sometimes when I haven't filmed for a while, I just need to sit down and film and try to do something. But yeah, for like wrapping up this video, I do going to continue with my theme weeks. I don't know how often, but I think maybe once a month and I'm going to try to figure out like a series that I want to do throughout this year. Um, I don't know, I had my Zodiac series a couple of years back where I did use the Zodiac palette from Colourpop and used each shade of the month and then I have had palette of the month that I didn't I, I was never finished with that one so yeah I don't know what I want to do for Siri this year I think though that I want to do something and do a set a little bit low down I just don't know what and I do not think I'm going to continue with my no buy maybe some sort of low buy I don't know um, yeah, and then not post that much, not like have the intention at least to post that much. I'm going to try to have the intention to post three times a week, um, just to see if I can get like a better, if I can plan this better or something, because right now it's, or in the end it has not been that good and I think I need to structure. I love that I've been doing YouTube for a long, long time and I still haven't figured this out. But I haven't figured out any any planning whatsoever in my life, so um, maybe that is just who I am as a person. <laughs> but I'm trying to change it, I'm trying to be better at it. But yeah, that was all for this video and um, yeah, if there is something special you want me to do this year please let me know. I know, I know, some things that I will do, I will do a favorite palette of 2022 and I'm thinking of doing a favorite base product as well. I decided on that yet, but I think and like maybe some skincare, skincare, I don't know, maybe. And yeah, is there something more? Yeah, I'm going to do one last thing with my no but I'm going to do a wrap up um a tag I, I've been working on a no by tag for a couple of months or a couple of weeks that I think I am done with so that will also come more than that I haven't planned but at, for some reason it, this doesn't stress me which I'm happy about because I don't like being stressed so yeah that was all for this video. I hope that you will still join me in 2023. And if you're not subscribing to the channel, please 
do you want so you don't miss any of my videos whenever they will come i will see when i will edit this one because editing i still don't think it's fun no i don't <laughs> so yeah i hope that you like this video and i hope that i will see you in the next one bye